electric supermoto load testing with 3.5 kilowatts resistance about 1 ohm cooling temperature now about 70 Celsius degrees controller temperature about 19 degrees uh, this is back, back voltage and this is the uh, shunt uh, voltage there we can see individual cell voltages uh, main voltages measured with this uh, 71 uh, Celsius degrees temperature and about uh, 60 amperes uh, power and that equals about at 66 uh, volts it equals about 3.4 kilowatts it's about 51 amperes in here and uh, we there is our BMS or protection system and uh, individual cell voltages are measured with, with the cell log analyzers uh, with the serial output and the serial output is read with uh, small processing software lowest uh, voltage is about 3.8 volts right now it's it's quite okay still here we can see it's 3.3.8 volts at this and there we can see about wait a minute that's that's not okay we can see about 3.7 volts so this is the lowest lowest and we are measuring first time this whole setup if it works or not and for now it seems that it it works we have disconnected the motor and connected the resistance resistor uh, directly to the motor and uh, we are controlling the load with the with the pedal or, or twist grip throttle so this is our testing setup for the electric supermoto right now electric supermoto testing continues this is our high-tech gripper for the twist grip <laughs> it keeps steady 48 Amperes. These are 70 amp hour Cocam high power cells and uh, directly from the resistor it says about 56 Amperes. This is well this is so hot it will chisel if you that's it, but we have plenty of cooling. <laughs> 78 Celsius degrees uh, temperature. Uh, this is our uh, resistor temperature. It's 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 right here, uh, and this is our controller temperature. It's it's located uh, right in the middle of the Kelly controller. Uh, uh, in the heatsink of the Kelly, so it's not warm at all right now. This is our shunt, uh, shunt uh, voltage, it equals about uh, 48 amperes right now. And this is our pack voltage, it's measured from here, from the pack. Uh, so, so this is our uh, testing setup for the for the supermoto. This is first cycle and uh, 14 amp hours right now, with about uh, 
3.14 kilowatts uh, of, of heating, <laughs> heating power right there. It heats a uh, little bit, but it's, it's okay right now. We have total amp hours 29. We haven't run at it at all yet. 177 amperes, I think it was when we uh, tested it some days ago. About 50 amps. One kilowatt is the yes one kilowatt hour of of power. These are there should be about 4.4 kilowatt hours, and it has taken about 15 minutes, 15 to 20 minutes now. So it should be at this rate. It should take about one hour and one and a half hour to empty this batteries and the reason we are testing is because we are eager to know if the setup we have right here is working correctly if it is then it will drop down the uh, power level level it's it's connected to the gripper and it will drop down nice and, uh, and and steadily so the so that the individual cell voltage doesn't drop below the threshold level individual voltages uh, and all the rest voltages so that's it